Good day everyone, I am Jake Yonko and I'll be reporting about twistron harvesters which are called carbonanotube yarns that are able to harvest electrical energy when stretched. So to start, we know that all over the world, there is a continuous development of technologies that promote sustainable energy including renewable energy sources from the ambient environment. At present, we greatly rely on converting mechanical energy to electrical energy such as hydropower and wind power which are two economically feasible options. However, different kinds of energy harvesters have been continually developed. For example, electromagnetic electric energy generators such as piezoelectric and ferroelectric harvesters are able to harvest energy, however, they produce low power densities, they are too expensive for smaller applications, and they only work well with low strain deformation harvesting. There are also ionic polymer metal composite harvesters and triboelectric harvesters, but they have not yet shown competitive performance as compared to other harvesters. Lastly, dielectric capacitors are known in converting mechanical energy into electric energy. However, they typically need high voltage input. So because of this, a group of researchers from the University of Texas at Dallas and a Hanyang University in South Korea developed an energy harvester made up of carbon nanotube yarn and they call it Christian Harvester. As I have mentioned, capacitor-based harvesters are widely used, however, we try to avoid them because they need an external voltage source in order to introduce charges in the parallel plates. In twist turn harvesters, carbon nanotubes are twisted into yarn using cone spinning and instead of applying external voltage, the yarn is immersed in an electrolyte bath which charges the yarn. When the harvester yarn is twisted or stretched, the volume of the carbon nanotube yarn decreases, bringing the electric charges on the yarn closer together and increasing their energy. This increases the voltage associated with the charges stored in the yarn, enabling the harvesting of electricity. The researchers of this new technology showed that twistron harvester could power a small LED which lit up when the yarn was stretched to 30%. When the yarn is stretched at 30Hz, the coiled yarn is able to generate a peak electrical power of up to 250 watts per kilogram. That's enough to power two 25-inch colored TVs or your washing machine at home. Also, the researchers attached the twist turn harvester into a shirt, and every time a person inhales, the yarn stretches and produces 16 millivolts of power. Although there are no patents yet about the twist turn harvesters since it was only developed very recently, there are already patents which are very related to it. The first one is about the spinning and processing of carbon nanotube filaments, ribbons, and yarns which already predicted the applications of carbon nanotube yarns in electrical energy harvesting. The second one is about supercapacitors which are made up of bendable yarns, specifically carbon nanotube yarn deposited with manganese dioxide on the surface. These bendable yarns were claimed to have superior electrochemical performance while having excellent mechanical strength and flexibility. For the applications, twist yarn harvesters can be used to power small sensor nodes and Internet of Things applications, including biosensors and small smart devices. They can also be developed into electronic textile. Although it is very expensive to make large carbon nanotube yarns, this technology can still be explored to the point where low-cost materials can be used to make giant ropes from cheap fibers, and then attach it to some floaters and throw it out in the ocean in order to harvest a large amount of energy from ocean waves. This technology will serve well in producing sustainable energy. Music